Uh, so in this video, I really want to talk about making shorter videos because uh, they can always be shorter no matter what we're doing with them. Uh, now, if you're like 99% of people, the first thing you did when you started watching this video was look down here. Uh, and figure out how long this YouTube clip's going to go and decide whether you're willing to sit through it. Uh, now, hopefully it only says about a minute 30 down there and you're like, yep, yeah, I'll watch that, no problem. So, make them shorter. Uh, the research is pretty clear on this. You can check this graph out if you want to. But basically, as a video goes on, you lose more and more of your audience and you notice their audience engagement. And one thing we want to do is keep our students engaged with the videos that we're making. So they need to be that, that shorter length. Now, the last thing I want to say about making shorter videos is if you do this, you can harness something that I like to call the Game of Thrones effect. Now, the basic idea is that when I watch an episode of Game of Thrones and it finishes, the next thing I want to do is watch the next Game of Thrones and then the next Game of Thrones. But if somebody said to me, hey, you should watch this great movie, it's 36 hours long. There's no way I'm even going to attempt to start watching a 36-hour movie. But I've happily watched three seasons of Game of Thrones. All right, so that's it. Make your videos shorter. And I've just come under one minute. Thanks, guys.